So I have this tile palette in my game, and I want to add new tiles to it without messing up the order of the old tiles. So I'm going to show you how to do that. The first thing we're going to do is open up the sprite map in whatever image editor you have. I'm going to use a sprite. Okay, and then I'm going to add a new new tile. I'll just make it a bright yellow square. I'll give it a blue happy face. Go ahead and save that. Export it and override the old sprite map. Okay, so we fixed the sprite map. Now we want to reflect those changes in the tile palette. So click the sprite map.png and then go to your inspector. Open up the sprite editor. Um, click on the slicing. Type, I'm going to do 16 by 16 um, grid by cell size with a center pivot. Um, these two options are not as important as the third, which is method. You have to select smart. What this does is add the new tiles onto the end instead of messing up the order or anything like that. So it preserves the order of the old tiles. It's not going to mess them up. You apply, oh, go ahead and slice that and then hit apply. Now we'll go back to our scene, go to the tile palette. Might take a second to update and add the new tiles in. So select the sprite map.png you might have to click off and then back on again but as you can see um, unity added it to the tile palette um, but it's not in the correct order it should it should look like this but it looks like this um, I really haven't found any workaround for this um, I know for me the best the best way to fix this is to just manually place them so drag your tile palette onto the main window away from the inspector and then inside your tile palette, hit edit, select the cursor icon, and then the move icon to move your tiles. Okay. Hit edit again and save it. So we added the new tiles into the tile palette, and we can place them into the scene just fine. Great. Okay. But what if we want to edit? one of our pre-existing tiles. So we can do that too. And the, the changes will be reflected in Unity. So I'm going to open up the sprite map again. Let's just add some random stuff to this wall just so we can see the changes in game. Um, go ahead and save that and then export it. And that time since since that sprite was already sliced, it automatically updated the tile palette. If we look at the scene, those changes are reflected. So that is how you add new tiles and update old ones in your tile palette. Bye.